deploying a taser to using pepper spray and stop sticks, this chase in Waverly finally came to an end in dramatic fashion. And within the last 45 minutes, we've learned that it was a trooper that fired their weapon. Both the Lancaster County Sheriff's Office and NSP were on the scene, and now LPD is leading this investigation with a stretch of Highway 6 still shut down at this hour. Check out this wild video sent in by a viewer of that driver and those cruisers ramming into one another. We're told this all started around noon as a domestic disturbance near the USA Pharmacy in Waverly. From there, and after spotting the truck involved, we're told the driver, 30 34 year old Trenton Engel refused to pull over with deputies calling this a very dynamic situation as he was hitting those cruisers. We're told that's when a trooper fired one shot and while it's not clear if Engel was hit, we do know that he was taken to the hospital with non life threatening injuries. The sheriff's office praising the response. They have very professional law enforcement officers that are working day in, day out to keep them safe and when necessary, put their own lives on the line to make sure that we're bringing what, what could have been a very tragic incident today to a, a mostly, uh, mostly safe resolution. Just last month, Engel was involved in a standoff in Pleasantdale, where he's accused of holding a woman hostage. After nearly four hours, he was arrested and booked in the Seward County Detention Center on multiple charges.